देन आफ्टर इलेस्ट्रेशन नंबर वन पॉइंट नाइन टू पॉइंट चार्जिस क्यू वन एंड क्यू टू ऑफ मैग्नीट्यूड प्लस टेन रेस टू माइनस एट कुलम एंड माइनस टेन रेस टू माइनस एट कुलम रिस्पेक्टिवली आर प्लेस्ड जीरो पॉइंट वन मीटर अपार्ट कैलकुलेट द इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड एट पॉइंट ए बी एंड सी शोन इन द फिगर नाउ सी charge q1 that is 10 raised to minus 8 coulomb charge q2 that is minus 10 raised to minus 8 coulomb electric field at point a now see the distance between q1 and q2 that is 0.1 a to sorry q1 to c And Q2 to C that is also 0.1 meter means this one is equilateral triangle. But the distance between Q1 to B that is 0.05 meter. And now we have to find the electric field at the positions A, B, and C. So first of all, electric field at A. So electric field. At A due to one, so electric field of charge one at A, so that is equal to K Q upon R square. As per that, we can write nine into ten raised to nine Q that is ten raised to minus eight upon the distance that is five into ten raised to minus two whole square, and you will get the answer. Similarly, see this distance is same magnitude wise. Both the charges are same. So, electric field due to second charge at A that is also K Q upon R square, and that will be the same one, 36 into 10 raised to 3 newton per coulomb. Now see the figure. Due to positive charge Q1, electric field at A that is outward means towards A to D. And due to Q2, that is negative charge, so its field that is also in the direction A to D because that is towards the charge. Means both the fields are in the same direction. So resultant field at A, that is E A equal to E1 A plus E2 A. So that is two times 36 into 10 is to three. You will get the answer. Now electric field at B. So that is due to charge one, K Q upon R square. So nine into ten raised to nine, ten raised to minus eight, five into ten raised to minus two whole square. Again, we will get thirty six into ten raised to three newton per coulomb. But due to this positive charge Q one, the electric field that is outward, so that is in the direction B to F. Then due to charge Q two, which is negative charge, so. E to B that is K Q upon R D square. Now distance between this second charge and B that is 0.05 plus 0.05 plus 0.05 that is 0.15. So K as it is Q 10 raised to minus 8 upon 0.15 square. And now whatever is the answer, but That field is towards the charge Q2, means that is in the direction B to E. So now both the fields are mutually opposite here. It implies that resultant field at B that is E1 B minus E2 B. You will get the answer. Then electric field at C again here. Magnitude wise, electric field at C due to Q1 and Q2 will be same one because magnitude wise both the charges are same and point C that is at the same distance from both the charges. So due to one at C, K Q upon R square, K Q upon now R that is 0.1 means 10 raised to minus one square of it, 10 raised to minus two. You will get nine into 10 raised to three newton per coulomb. And the same one that is of second charge, but electric field at C due to first one that is radially outward, and due to second one that is towards the charge. So 
here the angle between these two electric fields at C that is 120 degree. Because this is equilateral triangle, so this inner angle is 60, so this outer one that is 120. So resultant electric field at C that is under root E1 C, C square plus E2 C square plus 2 E1 C E2 C cos 120. So E1 C and E2 C same one. So resultant of this one will be E1 C and that is 9 into 10 raised to 3. And the direction that will be in between these two fields. So that is in the direction on right hand side parallel to A, D. Clear to all of you?